Hello and welcome to Don't Pull the Chicken Switch 1.5 in a Nugget. I'm your host Kit Alois checking in today from an entirely different uh, topography as well as weather. Checking in from Indianapolis where it's been raining piles and piles. Seems like everything's underwater. And the humidity is 20 times higher than it is in Utah, but it feels good. But I check in today and I'd like to give you a deep 1.5 minute nugget. As you know, if you follow me, I'm getting close to taking a hiatus from my nuggets after doing 500 consecutive ones. And I'm doing some reflection, some thinking, right? We're always on the verge, perhaps, of not following through, of checking in and out. I mean, we make commitments, sometimes haphazardly, and then we've got to hold ourselves accountable to get them done and uh, meet oh different maybe than you or many others that I encounter in my travels struggle with different challenges. So today's nugget is is a is a, a deep one, if that makes sense. Tell me how you think this one lands for you. Our fate is shaped from within ourselves outward, never from without inward. And that's a quote I came across uh, actually yesterday as well. So if you think, uh, really think about that one and really, and it took me a while to chew on that, in terms of our contribution to ourselves, to humanity, to life, to others, uh, it, we're, how we occur to others, how we show up, begins from ourselves outward and not from without inward. Meaning that we've really got to be aware of um, how we occur to others. And in the final analysis, sometimes we also have to make the hard decision around being able to just do what we feel is right. And, you know, I struggle with that one in terms of always making the right choices. And therein lies the balance, the joy, the satisfaction, the challenge, the game of not chickening out. So consider that as you look inward, right, and then work uh, it pr probably gets the best results. So chew on that deep one. I'm still thinking about myself in terms of making complete sense. Have a great day. See you next time.